Ground and Pound TV, Marc Bergmann, vor Ort in Berlin zur UFC Fight Night Berlin. Und äh, neben mir steht nun UFC-Debütant Viktor Pesta, der auf Ruslan Magomedov treffen wird. Äh, ein sicherlich sehr, sehr spannender Kampf zwischen zwei sehr starken Schwergewichten. Viktor, I just told the viewers you making your debut this coming Saturday. How do you feel before such a big night? Oh uh, yeah, I actually feel really good. I, I think I, I had a great, great camp. Uh, I had a great camp in Sweden with Alexander Gustafsson and his team. So I train with the best guys and I think I'm really ready for this. Yeah, we just talked to Magnus Sedenblad, I believe. He was also training with you, right? And uh, yeah, he told us only good things about you. Um, uh, we know you like to, you know, uh, close the distance on your opponents and, and take them down to the ground. Is this something you will also pursue on Saturday? Or did you have, uh, you know, learn anything new over in Sweden and, and you know, make, made some tweaks to your game plan and, and, and changed maybe the whole game plan? Well, I don't think I changed my game plan, but yeah, I, I a little bit changed my style, I improved a lot of things, but I think that my game plan is still the same. Now, you will be facing Ruslan Magomedov, also a very strong heavyweight, uh, um, also a guy who's making his debut in the UFC, I believe. Uh, you know, what, what do you think of him as an opponent and, and what kind of fight do you expect against him? Uh, yeah, I think he's really, really good, but oh, well, I think he's a really good striker. Uh, I didn't see him much, much on the ground, so I, I can't say uh, how he's on the ground. But his wrestling is quite good uh, as well. Uh, but I, I think uh, he, he's a heavyweight and he, he he's a striker, but but I think he uh, kind of missed knockout power. Well, I, I hope I, I, I will not not be knocked out after I said that. But uh, I, I said I, I saw that a lot of his fights ends by decision. Even if he's able to outstrike uh, his opponent uh, really easily, so so we will see. I, I, I will tell you after the fight <laughs> how hard is his punch. Yes. Uh, now you have nine fights on your record, nine pro fights. Um, no, all, all of them are victories, so does this, combined with the fact that this is your first UFC fight, add the pressure going into uh, this Saturday? Oh, well, you mean if it makes pressure, I, I'm undefeated? Yes. Um, not, not really. Uh, well, I, I don't think it's a so important thing, you know, and uh, I think uh, that the people, they, uh, they care too much about, you know, being undefeated on the record. Well, I, 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 I'm here to fight with the best guy, so uh, I of, uh, of course uh, I'm, uh, you know, uh, I'm admitting that I can lose, so I'm, I'm not afraid of, of being defeated, I, I'm okay with that. Now, uh, obviously you will be going into the Octagon uh, this Saturday to win the fight, but uh, can you give us a prediction on the outcome? How, how do you want to finish this fight? How, uh, yeah, give us a prediction for the viewers. Okay, uh, let's say I'll win uh, by uh, TKO from crucifix position in the second round. Well, uh, that's a very, uh, very precise <laughs> prediction. So uh, thank you very much for that, Victor. Um, thank you very much for taking the time. I know you have a lot in your schedule this week, and uh, we're looking forward very much to your fight on Saturday. Thank you. Uh, thank you too.